Hello everyone, this is Lamin Sani of LS Web Apps. And in this video, um, I just wanted to take a quick look at something that um, basically it sort of baffled me for a while, but until I came up with a formula um, after searching around on the web for a bit. Um, so it's like the distinction between arguments and parameters. So basically, um, wait, this doesn't really matter if you're working on your own. Um, basically, you know what to do in code. But when you're working with someone and you want to communicate to them, um, okay, I pass in um, the arguments and then um, the, you receive the parameters and then do something with it. Right, so it's very vital to understand the two, the distinction between the two. They are closely related, but not on the same. Even I, in my tutorials, have interchanged them for quite a bit, but then it's been bugging me. So I said, hey, you know what? Let me um, clarify the difference between these two. So now I'll do my best to um, use them appropriately, right? And the two are arguments and parameters, right? So um, an argument basically is what you pass into a function when you're calling the function. That's what an argument is. And um, a parameter is what the function um, accepts or receives. So in this case, uh, we're on CodePen. This is uh, an HTML uh, visual editor on the net. And uh, basically, um, I just created a simple JavaScript function here called myFunk. Um, so it's adding two numbers and returning the sum to you. So what I'm doing is I'm doing console.log and then calling the addition of two numbers. As you can see in the console here, it's going to show the addition of that. So if I change this four to five, we're going to get six once the addition um, goes ahead and um, executes. All right. So um, basically, in this case here, when I'm calling my funk, the arguments are one and five. OK, but the parameters are num one and num two. So that's all there is to it. Right. So now actually i am um, i went around and i searched online and i found a formula um that someone suggested on stack overflow and um after doing a bit of reading of course i found uh, um, the answer but um a quick way or an easy way to remember the distinction is argument since it starts with an a so it's the actual thing you're passing in so if you remember argument and you remember actual it means the the original thing that you're passing in since the function receives a copy of whatever you are passing in so of course it's the parameter but then argument is the actual thing okay so the next time you want to remember the two and it baffles you just remember arguments and actual right so that brings us to the end of this video and i thank you for watching i will see you soon cheers bye bye